Hey, what is going on everyone? My name is Daniel here and welcome back for another video. Today we're going to be talking about why Hangmin OS could be the best thing for Huawei and why Google is jealous from Hangmin OS. Okay, so the first thing which I want to address here is that Huawei made Hangmin OS because of the US uh, China trade war that happened back in February and because of that Google was actually banned on Huawei as well as Google services which means that you cannot run Google Chrome you cannot run Google Play Store and other Google services on Huawei devices now a lot of the Huawei devices like the Huawei P30 Pro and Huawei P30 were made be before the US China trade war which means they still get to run uh, Google services, the Google Play Store and other things but the newest device from Huawei which is the Huawei Mate 30 Pro which came right after the US China trade war which means this phone did not have the Google services at all now there was a workaround but uh, the workaround as well was banned it was cancelled now there's no way you can get uh you know google services on the huawei mate 30 pro but the interesting part which i really see over here is google is sort of jealous from woman uh, humming os and the reason is that huawei is one of the most selling manufacturers in the world one of the most selling smartphone manufacturers in the world now considering the fact like when the whole industry uh, saw a decline like Samsung saw minus 2% decline, uh, Apple saw minus 1% decline, Huawei on the other hand saw plus 33% of growth in 2018 which means that Huawei uh, you know gets Google services to more people uh, regarding uh, the market share. Now Google is actually upset because they are losing one of its biggest player in the market and if the biggest player is lost from Google and has its own OS which means that there is going to be a new software in the software chart. Uh, now Android has 78.4 market share in 2019 which means that uh, Android gets the most of the average consumers. Uh, Apple got a little market share but if Hangmin OS came it will dominate the smartphone market which means that this is a even bigger problem for Google even if the rest of the world don't want a phone with without Google services I think uh, the one place the one country which wants uh, a phone without Google services is China which is one of the biggest markets of the world uh, yeah, Huawei is the native brand of China and that is why people really really love Huawei uh, Huawei has a really good brand reputation as well and that is why even if Huawei got bankrupt in the whole world I think Huawei will still uh, keep its store open uh, in China markets because it's the biggest player over there uh, and I think Google has some working to do. They have to think that around. They have to get Google services back on Huawei, uh, which is part of their right because even if they don't do that, they will lose their own market share. And Huawei, on the other hand, is going to get a bad OS. It's just going to be bad for the companies as well as the average consumers as well. Now, a lot of people have been waiting for Hongmeng OS, and a lot of people have wondered that whether Hongmeng OS is going to come out or it's not going to come out. Now, it is cleared that Hongmeng OS is going to come out in UMUI 10, which is going to come this year or probably next year. Uh, but I'm really excited for uh, EMUI 10 and Hongmeng OS as well. Uh, stay tuned, we're going to show you some more news about that. Uh, I'm really excited actually for a new uh, you know operating system considering the fact that the whole market has been you know a little bit stable and a little bit more uh, compressed in the last few years I guess it's been static uh, nothing new is happening like only the only new things are happening are the notches and 
punch holes and I don't think I don't consider it real innovation what I consider a real innovation is a new operating system and other things so uh, it's been coming out and I will I will be you know informing you on this news so stay tuned subscribe and I'll see you in the next video